talking about happily ever after today and brides and the whole thing, it would be only fitting for you guys to actually meet Prince Charming. Our next guest stars in the huge Sunday night hit show, Once Upon a Time, and he has the tough, calm down, wait a minute. <laughs> He has the tough job of playing a character every woman would like to marry. Take a look at him in action. Are we really going to leave Regina behind? She's too dangerous to bring with us. Not yeah. Henry won't like it. She is his mother, despite all the horrors. Those horrors will continue. You want to give her another chance? Because every time we do, she... She slips, I know. What do we do? Instead of a second chance, we give her a choice. Please welcome a first-timer to our show from Once Upon a Time, Josh Dallas. just saw Prince Charming give me a little kiss. <laughs> that's uh, that's a great... not going to get me in trouble, is it? No, but it's a great first line. He says, honey, how was your day? Well, actually, Prince Charming gave me a kiss. <laughs> <laughs> so, as you know, Jennifer and Jennifer have been here. Mm. But we've been waiting to meet you. Thank you for making time for us oh, this time. Thanks for having me. Thanks for having me. You know, like I said to them, you never know in television. There are great shows that just don't make it, but this show seemed to be a huge hit, like right out of the box. But what I think is funny about playing Prince Charming is that there's a lot of expectations. There's a lot. lot of those names. There's a lot. And if I went if I went to work every day thinking, okay, I'm playing Prince Charming today, I would like <laughs> crumple into fetal position and cry in the corner. There's a lot of pressure. But it's also, it's, it's, it's kind of bad to be synonymous with Prince Charming. I mean, how do you go to Vegas and really have a good time? <laughs> right, exactly, exactly. Oh, there are wings. There are wings. There are wings. You know, when the ladies were here, we were talking about how much they love the incredibly intricate, beautiful costumes. I mean, in that clip we saw, you know, the fun thing about the show is you get to dress, you know, hip and contemporary and your leather jackets, but then you have these amazing costumes. Yeah. But I think, you know, for women, that's probably a little more appealing than for men. Do you enjoy the big, the big costumes? Of course. I mean, you know, it's like, it's a boy's dream. I mean, it's, it's one of the uh, reasons why I took the job is because I get to slay dragons. I get to kiss, you know, beautiful women. And yeah. I get to wear, you know, these um, amazing costumes. That are made it, is really like being, it is like being a kid again, isn't it? Uh, 100%. Yeah. And I get to use swords. You know, it's cool. The swords? Yeah. We're going to get to it in a minute, yeah. I'm excited about that. Um, but the season two finale is coming up, and this is a talk show, so mm -hmm. you must give us at least one spoiler. Well, I, a little I, one, just a little one. I can tr well, what I can say about this season finale is that, like season one, it's going to completely change the game for all these characters in the show, and it's going to go someplace that you do not expect. Hey, you know, that's a good question, too. Mm -hmm. the, one of the things that we love talking about when it comes to this show is that anything can happen. Yeah, can. Any character you know can pop in who would you put in if you were in charge you know, well, who would we see in season three you know i still hope we, we we keep delving into you know the fairy tale uh background and and i hope we see you know more like you know ariel and prince eric yeah. or uh, aladdin and the genie that whole yeah. world you know i think we can just go anywhere and we can go anywhere into literature too and you, you can know? make it anytime 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 yeah. You work a lot with swords. Mm -hmm. How much practice does that take to, like, to, to get to get good at that? Do you uh, go to takes, class? Or? Yeah, it takes a lot. You know, I, I trained as an actor and I did a lot. You know, at, at drama college, and uh, so I came to the project. I came to the show knowing, you know, how to use swords. And, oh, and so you could show off, like, from audition. I could show off. I could show off a little bit with it. I could teach you how to do some sword fighting. Well, it and, just uh, so happens. You should offer right. because we just happen to have a big old bucket. <laughs> Show me something. I suppose I get the call sword here. 
No, the, the, that's it's that's pretty rad. Is, that's this, is this a good one? That's that's a good one. So, do I these want are that serious. One? I thought these were going to be props, but these are the real deal. Please right. Don't come okay. Me too no, bad. you're going to be the attacker. You're coming at me. You're no. What, what do I do? I have no so, idea. I've never held okay. a sword in my life. Well, you're holding it perfectly fine. Well, nice. Right now. Yeah. I, I can it's handle it. It's fine. Thumb so, on this side. Thumb on this side. Doesn't no, matter. You're good, just like that. I was good like this. Uh huh. Okay. Okay. So now you're gonna you're gonna you're gonna come at me. You're gonna be like all the you know all all the girls all the women on our show are right. all you know. They're all bad. They're bad. You know what I'm saying? So this is where this is you have to get into that feeling. You're fighting for your for for happily ever after. Love it. Okay. So what I want you to do, I guess I want you to to, to slice like you're cutting my. There we go. And then, after that, you're going to go for this shoulder. Okay, so I'm going to come in Here, like that, and then, and then I'm going to go there, like that. And then you're going to go for my head. Oh, dear. You can do it. But I could, but... You can, so let's, let's you're, practice. You're not going to get, like, for real no. mad at me, are you? No, pretend no, no, for no, 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 right. <laughs> All right, go. Okay, so like so, this. I go like this. Let, this. Ah. 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 You're natural. natural. You're very fun. <laughs> I'm so taking this home. <laughs> <laughs> Once Upon a Time isn't a fairy tale. You can watch it every Sunday at 8 p.m. on ABC. Up next, I'll meet you in the kitchen. But I'm bringing my sword.